welcome you all today we are going to discuss energy losses in a transformer what is transformer transformers are most highly efficient electrical devices this a transformer is a static device and here we do not get to see any moments in its parts so no mechanical losses exist and only electrical losses are observed in the transformer in actual transformer output power is lesser than the input power the efficiency of the transformer is defined as the ratio of output power to the input power usually there are a number of energy losses in actual transformers due to this efficiency is always lesser than 100 percentage most of the transformers have full load efficiency between 95 percentage to 98.5 percentage what are the type of losses of transformers there are four losses a copper losses LD current losses, hysteresis losses and flux leakage. First, copper losses. The current flowing through the primary and the secondary windings lead to Joule's heating effect. And causes heating. Such losses are called copper losses. And this loss can be minimized by using thick wire which has low resistance. Then eddy current losses. The varying magnetic flux induces eddy currents in the iron core and causes heating. And this loss can be minimized by using a laminated core made up of stelloy and which is an alloy of steel. Then hysteresis losses. The repeated magnetization and demagnetization of the iron core caused by alternating input current. This results in the loss of energy. Then the power loss per cycle is indicated by the area of the hysteresis curve. The hysteresis loss is appreciable for radio frequency transformers. Then this loss can be minimized by using a magnetic material uh, such as uh, silicon steel and mu metal. This mu metal is a ferromagnetic alloy containing 78% of nickel, 17% of iron and 5% of copper. This mu metal has high permeability and low hysteresis loss too. Next, leakage of flux. The flux produced in the primary coil is not completely linked with the secondary coil due to the leakage. This results in the loss of energy. And this loss can be minimized by using a shell type of core. Thank you.